It goes without saying that the beginning of the 21st century may be called an age of amazing achievements in science and technology. The launch of the Ingenuity rotorcraft on Mars is one of the most recent groundbreaking events. By now, the helicopter has completed several test flights. And now let's look at each of them more closely. The first flight took place on the 19th of April 2021. That is when Ingenuity rose as high as 3 meters above the planet's surface and hovered there for almost 40 seconds. The helicopter also took the first black and white image using its navigation camera. The next flight took place on the 22nd of April. As it was completing its task, Ingenuity rose as high up as 4.9 meters this time and stayed up there for 51 seconds. In that short time, the chopper took its first color images. And here is what they look like. In these images, wheel tracks left by the Perseverance Mars rover can be seen. By putting together the acquired images, scientists at NASA created a short film demonstrating ingenuities hovering above the surface. The next objective to reach was the third test flight, which was successfully completed on the 25th of April. This time, Ingenuity rose 5.2 meters high and then it flew around 50 meters parallel to the Martian surface before safely returning to the starting point. This is what it looked like from the position of Perseverance. The rover managed to take pictures and record a video of the flight from its vantage point. And that's what the third flight looked like from Ingenuity's camera. Interestingly, Ingenuity developed a record speed of 2 meters per second in the course of the flight. With all these indicators, NASA was able to officially announce that the helicopter had successfully dealt with all the planned tasks. However, NASA decided not to stop there and carry on with test flights, with the next one taking place on the 30th of April. In the course of this flight, Ingenuity negotiated a staggering 226 meters within 117 seconds, moving parallel to the surface, thus beating its record and performing twice as well this time. This achievement was captured by Perseverance's cameras too. Naturally, all these encouraging achievements prompted the mission managers to set new objectives for Ingenuity. Right now, the helicopter is about to test functions that might be beneficial for future investigations of Mars. 
The new phase will start after the helicopter has completed its sixth test flight. And since Ingenuity is still in mint condition, NASA intends to continue using it to assist the Perseverance rover in its explorations. After its sixth test flight, the helicopter will have about two weeks to prepare for a new set of operations demonstrations. Focusing on technology tests in all of its previous flights, this time Ingenuity will move on to demonstrating its functions. For example, apart from one-way flights, Ingenuity will experiment with precision maneuvering, which will enable it to cover larger areas of observation. Besides, at the next phase, attempts will be made to give it more autonomy, so that it relies on assistance of the Perseverance rover team as little as possible. This means that Perseverance will be able to get on with its chief task, collecting samples of Martian rocks and sediments. As for Ingenuity, it has planned to be aiding the rover in coordinating its movements. To that end, the helicopter will execute short flights, accompanying the rover. This strategy will allow it to collect aerial imagery of the rover's targets, as well as to promptly work out the rover's potential routes to waypoints on the fly. Interestingly, these reconnaissance flights haven't been initially planned for ingenuity. This aerial scouting is a kind of bonus that the Mars rover team will benefit from and will be able to reach their science goals more efficiently. As for the frequency of the helicopter's flights, they will be considerably less numerous at this next phase. With one test flight every several days in late April, Ingenuity will now set out once every two or three weeks. The flights themselves are going to be planned in a way that they will not interfere with Perseverance's science operations. Thus, the mission team is currently planning to assess the effectiveness of such like flying aircraft on Mars. A new portion of data, beamed back by Ingenuity, will provide new insights into what the next generation of mini-helicopters on Mars should be like. The test flights, meanwhile, are scheduled until around the end of August. If all of them are completed successfully, NASA will be able to draw conclusions from the Ingenuity mission and proceed to develop new aircraft of this kind. We, in our turn, will keep you posted on the mission's updates. If you'd like us to carry on bringing you the latest news, feel free to let us know in the comments or just hit the like button by way of saying yes. And let's keep in touch.